I think we better talk this over like a couple of men. I'm broke. I lost all the money. I can't even feed you. I don't care. But tomorrow, we may not even have a place to sleep. I don't care where we sleep. Listen, I'm going on the road anyway. You know me, I'm the champ. I bounce back like that, right? So you go up to New York and you live with them. And if you don't like it, I'll put you in one of those fancy military schools where you can wear one of those hats with the strap under the chin and look like a big general. No, Pop, I don't want to be a general. I want to be with you, you promise. Please, Pop, don't send me away. They don't need me. You need me. <laughs> You get the idea I need you. I need you like I need a hole in the head. How can I operate with you around? I lost Cheryl, I lost the hotel, I'm broke. Only because I had you on my back all the time, that's why. That's why I couldn't operate. So you go in there and pack your clothes. I don't want you around anymore. Did you hear what I said? Okay, I'll go. But not with them. Champ. Wait a minute. Where are you going? What do you care? You listen to me. You're going to do as I say. You're going with Uncle Mario. No. One years old, and and you're a grown man at eleven. But he loves you, Allie. He really, truly loves you. I'll never speak to him again as long as I live. 